Hello friends, welcome to our channel Right Click Education. In today's video, we will learn how to implement Angular Material Stepper. So, a stepper is used uh, to fill the different steps of a form. Basically, so uh, without getting late, let's see how it looks like and how we can implement it. Okay, so open your Chrome type angular material open the official website of angular material that is material.angular.io click on components scroll down you can see in the side nav bar there are lot of angular material elements so scroll down click on a stepper so go in example scroll down so you can see right we have three steps to uh, complete a form application first is to fill out the name second is to fill out the address and then last is done so click on next so you see right the address has come then again click on next you can see right we are on the third step so this is how the stepper looks like now let's go and implement the basic angular material stepper stepper so click on api first we need to import the mat stepper module copy it go to your vs code Press enter, paste this mat stepper module here, copy this one under the ng module import section, paste it. Now we are done with the import part. Okay, let's go to HTML and try to write HTML for it. So, first of all, write mat. A stepper so we have this mat stepper tag inside this mat stepper we need to write mat step okay so suppose we have three steps so we need to write this mat step three times inside this mat stepper okay so copy this mat step and paste it here enter paste it here okay now what we need to do we need we need to give the level to this mat step right so let's give the level also ng template okay and inside it give a keyword mat step sorry we didn't give a space yeah so mat step level okay so this this is the keyword that you need you need to use to show it is a label okay now let's name it name it as content one okay now let's go to our ui and see how it looks like open your new tab type localhost 4200 
nothing is here right so let's again go back we have misspelled this ng template that's why it's not coming there now let's again go to the so you can see right this is three level mat stepper with the label of first as content one right now let's put some level to the other two mat step also copy this one paste it here paste it here and we will change the level to content two and suppose this one as done so to see like it's it's the final step okay now let's go again to our ui and see how it looks like so if you see right we have content one content two content three but how can we navigate from one content to another content okay so let's add one next button to it and add a property that is mat stepper next okay to that button now let's create one button here and uh, it should be mat button name it as next and bind property which is mat stepper next okay now let's see go to your ui you can see the next button here right now you are navigated to content 2 right so in this way we will add some add one more next button copy this to the content 2 also in order to navigate to the third step okay so let's add some content also okay so i will add suppose p tab and add right to it. let's go on ui and see so this content has been added right similarly i will add welcome to right click and then same thing i will copy and paste in other two steps also okay so let's go on ui and see how it looks like so if you see here right this is content one it has its content and next button if i click on this next button it will navigate me to the content 2 which has again one next button and if i click on it it will navigate us to content 3 okay so now we have see, seen how we can implement this uh, mat stepper so this is the simple and basic way to implement the mat stepper you can add forms here if you want you can add a form 
filled here here and here if you are like filling different step of forms and you need to bind the form controls to the mat step so that is another implementation and the third that i wanted to show you is the orientation so right now if you see this mat stepper is horizontal right but we can make it vertical also so in order to do that we can use one property that is orientation okay so type orientation equals to vertical okay now let's go to our ui and see you can see here right now the mat stepper has vertical view and if you click on it this content is shown next this content is so so in this way you can implement angular material mat stepper that's it for this video if you haven't subscribed our channel Please do subscribe our channel and share the video. Thanks and have a nice day.